best kept secrets travel. I'm so genuinely passionate about the wildlife out there and making sure that it's looked after in the correct way. I have to commend Australia and the quality of the zoos that we saw. Morgan wouldn't necessarily have gone to them. He might have done, but I'm really on going to these zoos. I would have definitely gone to Australia Zoo. So when so the first one we went to was Taronga Zoo in Sydney. One of the reasons I really wanted to go there was I have some of my really early photos when I was a tiny kid and lived out there where my mum took of me in Taronga Zoo. And she just, I mean, she spent the past 20 something years explaining it to me. So it was bucket list for me to do. Absolutely amazing work that they do there as well. And then also you've got Australia Zoo, which is where the famous crocodile hunter had his zoo. It's just the work they put in for any reptile is, you can't even describe it. The passion that's gone into that place, it is genuine. You can see it. The space that they create for yeah, all of the animals. That was the biggest else. thing that I found when going there was that the space that all the animals had. It was unbelievable. It was so big and so large. And one of my favorite things, crocodiles were amazing, but I quite enjoyed the almost interactive cages. So there were the massive ones that you could walk through. Yeah. And then you could go, you could feed the kangaroos or you walk through the bird cages and you have birds flying around you. And I've always I found that such an interesting experience that you don't really get here in the UK. Not in the same way. And I feel like having spent a lot of time around wildlife when I go to certain zoos, so... I don't want to put any certain zoos down, but when I've been to zoos in certain cities around the world, I can see the very negative impact that being in that constant loud environment has on mm. them in the small enclosures. But the enclosures that zoos such as Australia Zoo put their animals in, I do personally truly believe that they have the animals at the top of their list and it's not just about money or anything else. They do genuinely seem to care and want to make that bigger difference. And the education that they're putting out there as well, and especially when the Australia fires happened, the work all of these zoos, rescue centers put in across the country was just impeccable.